So this is our southern door that came with the GTO. Um, it just has one little bad spot in the very bottom corner there. Somebody's done a patch repair here before. We saw that. Um, the bottom of the door looks amazing. Um, no rust at all. Uh, it was painted and primed already. Um, but when I decided to pull the Bondo off anyway, I found all these holes, about 40 of them. So it must have been hit right smack in the center. And rather than pull the door skin off and push the den out, they just drove 40 holes and pulled it with a slide hammer we're not gonna leave it like this we are going to replace it with a skin and we'll show you guys how to do that so pull the old skin off is actually really easy you just take a grinder and just cut there grind the very edge off the door is folded over so if you just take that eighth of a eighth of an inch off and drill out the spot welds the skin will peel right off there's only a few spot welds on the inside of the door in between the window once you get those out um, just peel it like a can once the skin is off just take your hammer and dolly and just straighten the original edge and take some paint and paint the inside of the door might as well and that will protect it uh, for years and years to come before you put the new skin back on again the GTO's got an extra line, body line going down the bottom of the door there and it looks from this repo skin that they didn't shrink the steel so I'm just going to cut it um, and that way it'll follow the inside of the door uh, rather than fold itself straight because that metal isn't shrunk. Once you're happy with the uh, inner half of the door, it's as simple as just laying the new skin right on top. It, it has the edges folded over at a 90 already so you can't manipulate the skin in any way it really only goes on in one spot so make sure that all four corners are folded over right and are sitting in the right spot and work from one end to the other folding the last of that 90 over so it's tight don't do it all at once but go up and down the door about 10 times folding it a little bit as you go once you have the door skin back on and you can line up the gaps but only to a certain point and even your uh, your distances the crowns might not be 100% and that's where blocking is going to have to take over and your final prep will be to line up all the body lines 100%. You'll never get the door skin right off the bat without using filler. Um, it just doesn't happen. Hey, hey, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe because you never know what you're going to see next week on DeBoss Garage. If you like what you see, there's a lot of stuff happening to help support the channel. And remember, if you're not filthy, you're not rich.